Hey everybody, just wanted to give you a quick tour of the Check-In Easy iPad and iPhone app. So we're here on the home screen and you can see the unique ID. So any event uh, guest list that you upload to the website, well, you'll be given a unique ID that you can enter in there. The other option is you can actually put in your username and password and what that'll do is it'll pull up every single guest list that's connected to your username. But a lot of times you're going to give your iPad to somebody else at the door and you only want to give them access to that one event. So we've given you that kind of feature here. So we're going to log into this event. You'll notice it right away it tells you the name of the event, the total members, total check-in zero, yet to check-in is 11, and the date. So we're going to go ahead and check in some guests. So you can do that a couple different ways. You know, you can scroll, but you can search them by name. So we'll just start typing in Josh Carey, and you can touch their name, and then they're checked in. And so you can go back and look on the bottom here. It says checked in, and there's Josh, yet to check in, and then all. The other cool feature is our boarding fast feature. So this is for events that want to have super fast check-in, and maybe there's a lot of guests where you want to send each individual guest kind of like a boarding pass, the same way you would get one on a flight. And it kind of looks like this. You send every, every guest a ticket, the system automatically does it, and then you can use the cool scanner embedded or already installed on an iPhone 2 or, I'm sorry, an iPhone 4 or an iPad 2 that already has the camera on the back. So I'm going to demo that for you. I'm going to just gonna put that ticket behind and I'm going to scan it. And there it goes. It says Corbin Ball has been checked in. Now, if somebody tries to like sneak in or give their ticket to somebody else or send it around a couple of times and use the same ticket, we can scan it again. And it says this ticket's already been used. So that's kind of cool if you want to make sure you don't have crashers at your event. Um, and then you just go home or you can go to checked in and there it is, Corbin Ball. And if you ever make a mistake, you can just uncheck it and it'll show up in there again. Um, one of the other cool things, you can get a quick snapshot of the event just by clicking that little button and it shows how many guests are in, total yet to check in. Um, you can also add a guest on the fly if they come to the door. And this other cool feature, notify by email. So if you have a special guest coming and you want to notify the event planner, what this will do is as soon as that guest checks in, it will send an email out to the event planner's phone, either in an email or a text message, so that they know that, in this case, Jackie Long checked in, or your special VIP. It's kind of nice because I know a lot of event planners are running around crazy at the event, and they're always hard to find, and they always want to know when a certain guest checks in. And this is an easy way to do it. So that's our tour. Um, at the end of the event, you can always go back to the website, download the guest list, and it'll show uh, who checked in and at what time. Also, if you have multiple iPads or iPhones, they'll all speak to each other. So if I check in, um, you know, Lauren Smith, it's going to show checked in Lauren Smith on the other iPads. So you don't have to worry about doing A through K or K through M anymore. It's all kind of built in. So that is our tour. I hope you liked it. If you have any questions, go to checkineasy.com. Also call us or email us. We're happy to help.